Hello everyone, Sprint Brown with Deductions here, and today I'm talking about the take and play rolling stock. There hasn't been much take and play rolling stock, in fact, this is literally all of my rolling stock. This is all the trucks I have. So say if I was going to do a big goods train, I'd have to use literally all of this. These are the trucks that I would usually use. Now these are the ones you've seen in one, I think this is in one of my custom videos, I don't know. These trucks, I got the black marker, I used this one. At first, but then it didn't work out too well, and then I grabbed, and then I got my second one to use this. Anyway, these are mainly just plain trucks. This one has a troublesome face. Face. This one came with a mountain set that I've got. In fact, I think I can show you that mountain set right now. This is my bed, and under here is my mountain set here. It's a take-along set, if you guys know your take-along. And also a bit of a rare one. In fact, I got two... You can just about see it back there. And that came with that. And this is the rocking and rolling troublesome truck. Now, for some reason, on this taking play track in the middle bit, whenever it moves wrong, it won't do its rocking feature. And I've got two flatbeds, which I use for my express coach. And here is the chipper thing, Hector oil truck uh, van, which I sometimes use as a coach. Hector and crusher thing. Now, I Mattel, make more rolling stock, please. Make rolling stock sets, or truck sets, or a shunting yard set that comes with, like, ten trucks. Thank you very, thank you very much for watching, and thanks for watching, and bye for now.